Hello, I'm Adam and today I will show you how to configure and connect your OSD camera to your flight controller to use camera's OSD uh, without the joystick but using your transmitter. First of all, camera with built OSD is required, so first uh, check if your camera has the OSD pin. Ok, so how to connect OSD pin to your flight controller? You have to connect it uh, through resistor. There it is, and uh, it's a 220 ohm resistor. And in my case, I have connected it uh, to the PPM uh, pin. But in Betaflight uh, software, I will uh, reassign it uh, to camera control. Uh, we are in Betaflight, and we have to reassign our PPM pin to have camera control on this. So we need to go to the CLI, then uh, we have to write resource. Uh, then uh, we can uh, find ppm, it's uh, co9, so we need to free it, uh, resource, for, uh, resource ppm free, then we have to set camera control, uh, resource camera control 1 co9 set, then we can see there is already assigned, but Anyway, it was already assigned to the PPM, so I think it won't matter. We can check by resources. And it uh, changed already. PPM is just uh, 0. And the camera control is CO9. Ok, then we need to hit save and that's it. Once everything is correctly connected and configured, you can enter your camera OSD. How to do this? First, you, you take your left analog and move to the middle, then turn it right. And you can see the OSD camera menu appeared. You, have, you can move using right analog between the options, and you can go to video settings and change options like contrast or very important format. I'm using NTSC format because uh, the NTSC format has a resolution closer to my uh, Google's resolution and that's the rule by choosing PAL or NTSC. So let's change option contrast. We increase one and how to save it. Uh, after I increase the value I have to return to my menu and uh, select the save option. And that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Please leave a comment and hit the subscribe button. Bye!